Hello, everybody. Uh, Dr. Lushinsky and I just want to take a minute to, to say hello. It's been a couple weeks uh, since we've recorded a video and just had a couple things we wanted to say and share and um, wanted to, to do so um, as soon as possible. Uh, we've had, since we've last recorded a video, we've gotten some guidance that we're going to be doing school virtually for the remainder of the school year. Uh, which is until June 4th. So that's been communicated to you uh, in some different ways, but we wanted to, to, to mention that again to make sure that you kind of knew when, when we were going to be um, wrapping up the year academically through the virtual classroom, uh, and that'll be on June the 4th. Sure, we have to wait for this guidance to come out as to what our next move is. So I know some of you are thinking about the end of the year activities and things that are going on, um, you know, or how am I going to return my library book or, um, what about the things that I left in my classroom? And unfortunately, we have to wait till closer to that date um, till we have that guidance to make those decisions. So hang tight, don't worry about it. It's all on our radar. And um, as soon as we have, we're closer to the end of the year and we have the guidance that we can work under at that time, we will um, be communicating all that type of information with you. So I know that a lot of people have questions out there and I definitely would too, but it's on our radar and we will handle it as it comes. Absolutely. Uh, in the meantime, we all wanted to, first of all, you know, talk about some of the things that we have seen since we've been doing this since April 1st and spend um, about three weeks here today. So uh, both Dr. Lashinsky and I, I know, have been very impressed with the work that you're doing. Uh, we've been able to get into your classrooms and click on some links and see some of the work that you've been able to submit and um, how hard you've been working for your teachers. And we want to thank you for that because it's, we know it's not easy and it's not as, as fun as being in school a lot, of the, a lot of the time, but you are working very hard and, and we appreciate that. Um, to families, we wanted to say thank you for your hard work and helping kids get logged in and, and be able to access the material and trying, you know, and trying to, to shift to this virtual environment. Thank you for all the hard work you've put in. We've even had um, some families get together and, and create some videos and things for their teachers to let them know that they're, um, they're, your children are missing their teachers. And I know that's been very much appreciated. Um, there was a, a video also that was created by the teachers and the faculty and staff here um, that we shared on social media with families to, you know, let us, let you all know how much we're missing you. So, uh, that being reciprocated in some grade levels, I know is very much appreciated. And, you know, um, thank you for all that. And it's, 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 I know not as effective as being in school, but it's a way that we've been able to stay connected to. And I think that, um, that's been very beneficial for everybody just to see everybody. Um, and then lastly, I, I, I wanted to just thank you all for your feedback, uh, both positive and negative. I've had phone calls and emails with a lot of family members, a lot of parents about um, some things that they thought could be do, done differently. And we've made some changes with some things that we've been doing uh, as part of that feedback, but also um, the words of encouragement and the thank yous and the, and the, um, uh, the, the positive uh, feedback. We, we appreciate all of it. And um, you know, we're just trying to make it as, as effective as we can. So thank you all for, for working with us as we, as we ruled this out. Absolutely. There's a lot of really cool stuff going on on social media right now. Mr. Wilson just mentioned, you know, those very, very thoughtful videos, um, slideshows and YouTube video made by our families. Um, I know that that was um, much appreciated by the faculty and staff here at Richland Elementary. There's also the fitness challenge that will be happening till the end of the year. A lot of cool stuff going on there. Um, also, your teachers are still submitting um, activities and instruction that's going on in the virtual world. All really good stuff. So I know a lot of us use social media to stay connected, and I really feel like um, the presence at, on our social media page at Richland Elementary has made me feel connected to the school. Absolutely. One thing that was been uh, has been posted in the last couple of days here, and has been um, been going on is is we've now have our uh, meals or grab and go meals. Uh, the information to sign up for that is on our social media page as our website. So if you are in need, uh, please sign up uh, by tomorrow, Thursday, April twenty third, by noon, and and get signed up if if you are in need and and at any child from uh, eighteen years of age or under. So if you need help, um, that, that that resource is available to you. Sure. Well, that's really all we have for today. We just wanted to check in, say hello, thank everybody, and um, remind you about our meals and how to sign up for those. Um, if re please remember that if you um, have any questions, please don't hesitate to out to your teachers, the main office, uh, Mr. Wilson or myself, and we're glad to help. Um, so please let us know if there's anything we can do for you. And bye for now, Richmond Elementary. Bye, everybody. Thank you.